Ramveer, very good morning to you. Um, this deal is obviously, a, you know, this is key to whether we get the trade talks, but it's a massive amount of money and people will be complaining that is money that could have been spent on services which need it here. Absolutely, and they might well be angry with Theresa May, but don't forget that prominent Leave campaigners Boris Johnson, Michael Gove, Liam Fox, all have been in this Brexit war cabinet meeting over these past few months and will have agreed to this uh, upping of the divorce bill. So perhaps it's them that Brexit voters should be angry with. Of course, the danger has always been that uh, without a breakthrough on the money, that there would be no Christmas trade talks. And just to remind you what this money is for, what the EU wants it for, it's for EU projects that we've already signed up for, it's for loans that need to be repaid, it's also, and I think this is the thing that really rankles people, it's for pension pots for EU Commission uh, civil servants. And so all of that, and look, you know, there is a, a recent poll which said that something like one in 10 voters in Britain thought that maybe 30 billion pounds was acceptable. But of course, this is uh, 20 billion pounds more than that, at least, because when this final figure is comes out, whether it ever comes out, we don't know, actually. It could even be up to 100 billion, uh, some financial experts are saying. Here Here's Nigel Farage. This is a complete sellout. It's a sellout of what 17.4 million people voted for. It's a sellout of our national interest. It is not worth it at any single level.